Hello, everybody, and welcome back to more Hades. We got Exegriff, the Rail of Adamant. The Adamant Rail. I believe it goes by both. I mean, when I purchased it just now for eight keys, it, uh, it, it told me both. But it's our final weapon we got here. And it's a weird one. It's, it's one of the weirdest weapons in the game, in my opinion. There's some very cool variations to it later, but for now, it is a gun where you just... Hold down left, you got ammo right down here, only 12 shots before we get to the point where we can start upgrading our weapons, which I'm actually not sure when that is going to start happening. Uh, but we can fire, you can reload early, uh, you do have to pretty much uh, stand still while firing, you can move while reloading though, like that. Special is a very slow rocket AoE, and your dash attack is effectively just a continuation of the same base attack it, it really is it's, it's a very strange strange weapon benefits a lot from multi hits as a result i think i'm going to see if we can get a multi-hit focused build going let's check out some dionysus action and uh as i said before we're gonna be going through we're gonna get a win on heat zero with That's all of our weapons before we lean too far into anything else here uh, did I spend anything in my mirror? I'm not sure. I don't Death actually remember. I think I did. Death and I. Best to get accustomed to the both of us. Okay. Okay, Papa. No, not on your life. I mean, no. But yeah, we should get Dionysus right away here. Say, man, if I'm not mistaken, I think you got yourself a bottle of ambrosia there. I had no idea you could get that stuff downstairs. Do me a solid, though. Hang on to any more you find, or better yet, give it away. I'd hate to think even a drop has gone to waste. All right. So here we go. Good. Attacks, inflict, hangover. That is exactly what I was looking for because I've not picked it up in the past because a lot of the attacks are, uh, they're a little slow. They're a little slow and hard to stack things quickly uh, because the hangover effect can stack up to five, at least right now, until we maybe get another upgrade to it in the future it stacks up to five and it does damage over time based off of the uh, the stacks so boom look how quickly we can get it up to stack five it's actually ridiculous and that damage is so so good uh, it scales in a very weird way uh, I find that poison scales better with pomegranates than a lot of other things is there I thought I heard a chaos gate I guess not but anyway we got a hundred HP to start with normally we've been starting with either the uh the backup life or the good old-fashioned uh just bonus bonus hp both of which are super good and handy look at this we just we just get the stack up to five and then we really just don't have to look at this suckers ever again uh but we can hopefully get a build that's super focused around this in the sense that uh ooh, ooh both are good I'm actually going to go for darkness right now. Slowly get on that grind to get our final... There's a nice, good old-fashioned chaos gate right there. See if we can get ourselves to the point where... Oop. <laughs> we can get that extra death to fight. Uh, HP or sacrifice HP? I'm going to sacrifice HP. It's, it's always a tough... The toughest choice with it is should I sacrifice that other room is really the hardest choice. Okay. For the next time, the next one you catch every time you attack, you get hit for three. Eh, that doesn't sound so great. Every time you special, you lose a little bit of HP, but then your special does more. Or for the next three encounters, enemies infernal bomb you, and then all of our yeah uh, boons are higher ranked. I, I I'm a little more interested in that. Uh, let's go for si what am I say? Sisyphus, 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 Sisyphus. Hello, hello, Prince. You've been gone for quite a while. Why? I heard tell you made it all the way outside, and I believed it for a while then. Yet here you are. What happened, might I ask? I made it out of here indeed, sir. I always said that I was leaving, but turns out there was good reason for me to come back. Not the least of which is visiting my friends from time to time. This is, uh, this is dialogue I've definitely not heard well, before. I'm certainly delighted to hear that, so long as you've achieved what you set out to do. But 
What brings you back again this way? More than a social visit, I presume. You're right. I'm back because I'm leaving once again. Something I have to do if I get up there. Though I should be back before long either way, I guess. Going to try and make it out of here again and again, is it? Well, they say repetition is the key to mastery, Prince said. Now here, I'll send you on your way. As much as I love Sisyphus, I gotta talk about his face for a second. It creeps me out. I mean, first of all, eyebrows for days. Second of all, it's just something, there's just something a little, a little unsettling about him. I gotta be real. Then here you go. Boom. Came Sheets here for made. the darkness mostly. Ooh. Okay. Farewell, then. I also can't wait to get to the bottom of our mirror. So I'm definitely gonna wanna make sure. Wah. Make sure we get our keys. I actually don't know how to fight this guy very well. Also, does the poison go away when he teleports? That is rude! He actually counters our build pretty hard strictly because of that. We'll be okay. Okay. I'm... Wow. This is, uh, yeah, he's not a guy I uh, know how to fight super well. I've only fought him maybe, like, one ever, one other time. Perhaps we could go out and meet some mortals. I know all too many maidens and or noble gentlemen who'd absolutely love to get to know you. Okay, so this is a tough choice because I want to get this. One, because it's really good. Two, because it is part of our faded choice. But I can't not get life affirmation this early on in the run Tartarus, it's such a big deal even from other condemned souls they're only visitors those fool enough to attempt escape let's do this again sometime all right it, it's like it's a tough choice i mean i'm hoping we will get another really good call like that in the future hell i wouldn't even mind getting that exact call again in uh, in the future in this run but it is just, you see that boon this early in the run, it is almost impossible to pass it up. It's going to uh, to add up to a very, very large sum of HP over the course of run start to finish. Like, it'll be, it'll be like 100 HP or something. Okay. So, boom, that is an upgrade from 5 to 7 damage per tick. The fun thing about Hangover... I also been informed that they have patched this so that you actually get more gold the more that uh, the more enemies that you kill. So there actually is a benefit to uh, to going for actually you know killing the enemies, which is good because there there was no there was no benefit in oh my god in the past, and it felt pretty uh, it felt pretty silly about you know why would I even bother, why would I worry why would I care? Okay. We are taking a little bit more damage than I would like here. But this is always the thing that happens with me and the gun. It, like, you lock yourself down in place pretty hard. Unless you get, like, a lot of, uh, a lot of dashes, I find myself getting really... Hit, like, hit quite a bit when just sitting and... Whoa! <laughs> sitting and jumping there. Did we really get money there? Did we really get, like, a lot of money? Doesn't feel like we got a lot of money. Yeah. Sure. We'll get the attacks to do extra damage. We'll just make it so we have a nice, easy transition into uh, the next floor, into Asphodel here. Ooh. We can really just do, what, like three hits and be done with these guys? Two hits? Two hits is enough. Though, of course, you know, you can... Uh, Obviously, kill them a bit quicker. It can be good to make it so they don't shoot out their projectiles a little bit quicker, but tis what tis, we are very, very beefy. Very, very beefy. Whoop, whoop, whoop. If we could get some piercing through the uh, the Daedalus Hammer, I think that could go very well with this run. I know that is an option with the Daedalus Hammer for the gun. Of course, unless it's been removed or changed. Which is this is all things these are all things that can be reality. I I don't know. I, I did not uh, I normally read the patch notes very thoroughly uh, For a lot of the games I play, but I did not for this patch and that was for the 1.0 patch and It's kind of on purpose 
One, because, like, it's the final big patch. I kind of wanted it to be a fun, uh, trickling surprise. Two keys is hard to pass up. Like, a, a surprise over the course of the, uh, the series here. And the other was, one, it was just a staggeringly huge amount of patch notes. It was actually really massive. Ooh, there is a fishing spot. I also don't think I... Uh, I don't remember if I turned in my fish from the last run. So we're going to get an extra big reward at the end of this, which is good in my book. Hip, hip. Pop and lock him. Not to see in all that red. Oh. I get every... I suck, Blasted man. I suck at fishing. You suck at fishing. Uh, what is our next room that will help me decide? I I'll tell you what. This should almost guarantee us epic quality boons from Dionysus, which I am very interested in. Hangover afflicted foes afflict it on other nearby foes. Here's a weird thing about hangover is it makes it so so we can only have it fi stacked five times and our attack our attack hangover does seven a tick this spreading one does six a tick so that makes it so if this one i mean because and, and we're going to want to try and focus up on basically buffing up only this one right here so if this gets up to 10 damage a tick, and this does 6 damage a tick, and that takes the spot of the 10 damage a tick, it could be kind of frustrating. I'm going to go with this one, because these are both only good in AoE situations anyways. Uh, this is better in situations where there's two enemies. That's like that's kind of the big thing. I'm going to go with the bad influence. I think it could be good. Uh, and there's even places on... Most of the fights where, aside from, um, no, even nice this one, to meet you. where this can be relevant. Most of the boss fights. Just not on the Theseus one, which is going to be a bummer, but oh well. That's the only, uh, only very obvious situation where I can see the other one being much better right now, but oh well. Hey, you must be one of Meg's sisters. Nice to finally meet you. My name is Agrius. Not murderer. Definitely not. Murderer. Murderer. That's me. Um, look, I've done I mean, some no. things that maybe aren't great, but I am very, very sure I haven't murdered anyone. Haven't I? Is it not murder because, like, when we kill Papa because he just comes back? Is it? Is it not murder because it didn't stick? Is that what it is in your book, Mr. Zagreus? It's not murder if it doesn't take. Okay got ourselves this is the final version of the uh, uh, initial boss here she's definitely uh, she's a, she's a bit wacky she's a bit of a cuckoo if you ask me Oop. but we're doing okay we're doing just fine it is definitely worth firing even when she has the stack of five Oop. There's just really not a lot of space to move around on this fight. That's always the, uh, always the big thing. Whoop, whoop. And we got her. She's done. Not too shabby. Not too shabby. Not one of our strongest victories we've had this week. <laughs> but still a pretty, uh, pretty obvious clean victory. You know, I mean, we got the extra two death defies and everything in our back pocket if we need it. So here is where we can do some interesting things. We could keep our keepsake, how come all my keepsakes or here? we could not do that and find something else. Because there's really, like, there's the, the reason to keep it now is to make it so our Dionysus boons are higher rank. I feel like half the reason I typically take these is just so that I can make sure I, um, Make sure I get the boon I want right away. So I kind of want to go for a little bit of Adamant Arrowhead. Because there's a couple boons for Artemis that I think would go really well with what we have. And I'm going to get the upgraded rarity. See you there's the one that makes it so we fire out arrows whenever we hit an enemy with uh, an attack. Which can stack really well with the gun. There's also 
uh, pressure points, making it so literally everything can crit does really well. The Asphodel Meadows. Oh, baby. Because that means that our poison can crit, and we just hit a lot of times. It's just, it's a really good thing to have. It's a really good thing to have, that's all. So if I could get one of those two, that's kind of what I'm thinking right now. Otherwise, we could have tried to fish out like a defensive boon of some sort. Which in the past I would maybe do with uh, with ones that give death defiance. But unfortunately, they changed it so they don't add death defiance anymore. The only one that adds a death defiance, I think, is that legendary chaos boon we had uh, a couple days ago. But I don't think any of the gods ones do anymore. They just replenish. They replenish a death to fight if you've already lost one. Uh, attack seeks the nearest foe and deals 10% damage, plus 10% damage. I, I think this is new. Attack is faster, more accurate, and gain plus six. A specialist plus three extra base damage in a large area, but it can hurt you. No! I gotta be honest, as much as I think this is better, this is probably, like, this is better for us. I like the thought of that, and it's new to me. I would love to get, so this actually might eat our, uh, our boon upgrade that we have. This is interesting. I, you know what? I like it. I like it. It's definitely, we definitely get the accuracy up. Can fire from off screen really easy. You know, I'm happy about this. This is a, it's a fun one. I like it. I like it. I'm glad I went for it. Even if it may not be uh, technically as good as the other one for our exact situation. We also might be able to uh, sneakily get a backstab. Which would be interesting. I would love an attack speed up. Let you know my sister Artemis is out looking for you. You should be running into her any chamber now. Yeah. Move faster after you dash. Briefly become sturdy. Move 100% faster. Pose drop the gems faster. Let's go with this one. Sturdy is. Uh, I'll, I'll explain it again. Makes it so you take a little bit less damage and you cannot be interrupted by taking damage. Which is a pretty darn good one if you ask me. <laughs> What are you, my comment section? What? Come on. Genuinely, I gotta say, the Hades comment section is by far the best and nicest comment section I've ever had on any series I've literally ever released. Ah, so for that, I have to say an unbelievable thank you. Literally, like, not even close. Not even close the nicest, best comment section I've ever had. So you guys are the true MVPs. Huge thank you for that. Huge thank you for that. Cannot thank you enough. Super appreciated. Your special inflicts hangover. Your call inflicts hangover. So the call inflicts hangover that does 17 every tick, so I'm way more interested in getting that, even though it's a double hangover. Also, this just is, this is just horrible synergy with our current weapon. Or It's just... Ter just terrible. Just actively terrible. It's so slow and it does basically nothing. That we had something special going, no? Look here, little godling. Let me save you lots of future suffering. I happen to be the jealous type. Okay. All right. You won't appreciate this. So we want to make sure we do uh, hit, you know, three enemies. If we can hit three enemies, make sure they stay uh, all poisoned. This damage. Oh no, we got stunned. Three of them need to be poisoned. We can do a big old extra blast of damage. There is the call from uh, Dionysus. It's a very good one. It's a very good one. Okay. Okay. Indeed. Oh, boy. Oh, my God. The stun there. The stun. I, the stun. This is... You know what? She sucks. I know we got to avoid this heart, but that's just... That is... Oh, What? This is, uh, she is probably my least favorite god to anger. Holy moly. It does an AoE, that's what. Are you kidding me? They made her so much worse. So much worse. Not a fighter, dearest. So how about we call this matter put to bed and get on with our lives? 
Dear God. I feel fabulous. <laughs> I don't, no, I don't. That was, uh, that was extreme. That's like, it's not stun lock territory, but it's, uh, if you can, which is stun a lot territory for sure. This, uh, this is probably a pretty decent boss to get with our current setup. I would love to not lose my death defy. Okay. I think we're good. I think that's it. That was not too bad. I'm with you every step to your rival, Zagreus. Then I will probably ignore you like the rest. Just warning you ahead of time, all right? Hmm. Hmm. Dash strike deals more damage. Is not very good for this. Because it's just like 70% extra damage. It makes it so one of our hits that. One of our hits that does 10 damage when we dash will instead do 17 damage. That's the net gain of 7 damage every whatever. Like. I don't know. That's it's not that much. It's not that much. It's not that good. Attempt. I'm. I'm, I'm probably gonna go with this. We definitely did not get what I was hoping to get there. But that's all right. That's all right. That's okay. More drinkins. Oh, you have to be kidding me! I want it so bad, but it's such a bad idea. I'm gonna just uh I'm gonna stack to five and and move for now. Gonna get basically as far away as we like logically can in a safe manner from enemies. Okay. Get the skulls. They're a very easy one to have on our uh, one out of three, basically. Good enough. Good enough. How much is it? <laughs> Hi. Going in. I'm making a dumb choice. I know I'm going to die. I'm going to die once. But I'm kind of willing to sacrifice it just to see what we can get. Uh, move speed down. You take extra damage afterwards. This. This. This, this all, this all is so bad. This all is so bad. I'm glad that we are at least going here. The unfortunate truth is we're going to have to fight this boss with a very bad setup. The dash deals damage when you when end up this week. I'm, I'm going to say sure. Sure, sure, sure. Hey, Charon, I'm an Asphodel now, aren't I? I'd always heard this was some flower-covered meadow-type place, not such a terrifying hellscape. Couldn't agree more, mate. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, this is going to be a very frustrating fight. This is going to be a very, very frustrating fight. If we can make it through here alive, uh, and by that, I, I even just mean... Gets hurt. Literally, uh, not losing a death of I. I'll be so pleased. Like, we have a pretty decent build for him, I think. I really, I do. Okay. One, two, three, five. One, two, three, four, five. Just basically stack them all up, baby. Very good. Very good build for this. Very good build for this. I did just literally walk right into it, but super nice. I am going to save my uh, cast or my, uh, my call for the final phase here, I believe would be a good enough idea for me. Okay. 
Got the hangover effect on a lot of people here. Good, good, good. Are we on in three? It doesn't matter. I think we killed. I think we killed all. We killed all. We're good. Ladies and gentlemen, it was an easy fight. It was a graveyard blight. I did the mash. We're getting towards Halloween here, gang. Hydra vanquished. That was actually uh that was actually very, very easy. Our type of dash that we have does help, like a lot, I feel. And boop! They're already expecting you up in Elysium. Alright, so now as we enter Elysium. I am getting to the point where I wonder if I should. It kind of bothers me that the Lambent Plume is in between here. Like, I just want all the god ones in a row, right? It's kind of weird, don't you think? Um, What do I want? Well, of Charon's Lord, you'll bonus damage here at 30% HP or less. Damage, no, terrible. I, I'm gonna go with, God, I don't know. None of these are really uh, standing out to me so much, so I'm gonna go with just the flat HP here. And that just seems right kismet. There. Why does it not let me check? <laughs> bad, Get me bad, 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 bad. Uh, doing damage to undamaged foes, doing more damage to undamaged foes is the same sort of thing as saying like that that we were talking about before with the dash damage upgrade. Yes, we do more damage with our first hit. Another day. Oh, so cool paradise. when it literally is just a good old fashioned uh, 10 damage. Yes, we will do 15 damage with our first hit. 616, sorry. It's just not very much. It's not very much of a, of a thing worth writing home about. Oops, at all. As far as gun builds go, this is a pretty good one for this, uh, for these enemies, it seems. The homing, especially. They're just like stinky dinky, uh, little slippery fools. And having the extra homing to, to bop them is definitely, definitely a good get. I, if I can get attack speed. Attack speed would be very, very nice. Yes, we would have to reload more is kind of the, uh, the, oh, the bummer scenario there, but that one's real. I, are you are you are you kidding me? Uh, all the shots kept on getting hit on the corners. Okay. Stack them. Um, I mean, the thing is, the poison does not transfer to the child right there. So we do have to keep that in mind. How many more of these are there? Ooh, baby. That should be some damage. It is some damage. I, I think that maybe the meta for us right now is stack everybody to five and then AoE blast them. Yeah. All right. Ooh, I'm sorry, Flurry Cast, but. I qu quintuple Dash. I can't not take Quintuple Dash. Who dares? So we need more damage from behind. That's gonna be. Eh, you know, it's not gonna be that big of a deal, really. It'll be. It's helpful, and we will try to utilize it. But I don't know that you can backstab with a special, can you? I don't know that you can. And, uh, like, we can backstab with our bullets. We cannot backstab with poison. Sir, you need to go. Sir, you need to go. I don't think we got very much. 
we can get to 150 uh, gems, we will unlock the ability to get more stuff from the Infernal Troves. And I'm looking forward to that. That's another way to increase our meta progression uh, pretty darn quickly. Stack it up, stack it up, stack it up. Want to make sure we get three with it at all times. Three at all times. Whoop. Did we... I saw the backstab. I'm for science. I feel like that would have been a backstab. That would have been a backstab if it could backstab. That would have been a backstab if it could backstab. Important info to learn. Oop. Good aim. Good aim! Okay. Get them all AoE'd up. Definitely. It does more damage, so it's worth worth doing over our base poison, which is wonderful. Glad we have justification to do it, and it's not just like, well, why would I do that when I already got the five stack of poison on him? That does help us out. Quintuple dash is one of my favorite things in the game. Especially, like, it helps out with the, the weird lack of mobility you sort of get with this gun. Let's see. Demeter has an interesting... Okay, I probably should have gone for Aphrodite for the, a chance of getting a duo boon. But Demeter has an interesting boon that I would like to get. That I'll explain if it shows up. Let us see if you are fit to face him once again. You mean face both of you together, which doesn't seem particularly fair. It is very true. Life isn't particularly fair, short one. Nor death. I'd have expected you to know as much. But here, I have your know fair fight. Nothing. Okay. I think we're going to do a lot of stick and move, stick and move. So we got to keep the jam in. Ooh, our range is not very long. Shall I? Yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, ooh. Keep moving, you doinkus. Me. Me, the doinkus. By the way, I always try to make sure I make it clear when I'm uh, I'm roasting myself and not not the game. I wouldn't dare roast Hades. It's like, I mean, like I gotta be honest. I I'd have to think about it a little more to be like a hundred percent confident. But like, it's gotta be my game of the year, right? Like, it's gotta be. It's crazy good. It's so good. What did he get stuck on? Fight's taken definitely a bit longer than I would have maybe uh, preferred. Oh. That. Finally, man. Yikes. You're a chunker. You are a chunker. I guess I win this round. Our family, why, I think we understand something of loss now, don't we, Zagreus? Unlike the mortals on the surface, always begging me for plenty. They'll get none. But as for you, I have a plethora to offer. All right. Okay. So, this one's really good, but I'm going to say no. This is what I was looking for. Your boons become common, then gain rarity every three encounters. This is one of the... Uh, I, you may have heard me talking in past episodes how I say there's weird ways to get things up to heroic... This is one of the ways. If we can get this on our base attack, very cool. We did not. Then that would have been amazing. So these got ranked down, down to common, which is not that big of a loss. But they will slowly get ranked up. It's still, it's still late enough in the run, or uh, early enough in the run where these will reach max by Hades. They will be bad for our boss fight here, but I'm willing to take that penalty. Uh, I'm excited to see. This will not hurt us in this boss fight. 
This I probably is not going to hurt us in the boss fight really either. I don't know how much I would really be using that. Uh, I am relatively, relatively displeased with the uh, the outcome of that one there. Whoop. I love the like getting that one and getting the uh, the epic version of it where you get three boons all going all the way up to heroic or something. It can be really fun. I, I don't know, like it's kind of a it's a weird value proposition because it costs a whole boon. Uh, see Daedalus, take Daedalus. It costs a, an, an entire boon, so it's hard to say that it is, like, a no-brainer. But it's just, it's fun. I like it. I, especially, I, it's one of my favorite boons to get for some reason. Because I, I think I like to build my runs around a very, very small core of, uh, of a certain amount of boons. And, like, I kind of like to branching path grow my run from there. Like, how do I get a run that will help out the help out my base attack is kind of where I'm at right now. Like, I want to have a, a good old-fashioned poison-spreading bonanza. So, getting things that just literally upgrade the rarity, potentially, I like that a lot. We got mediocre RNG, but it's okay. The rail's hidden power. Your attack deals damage in an area and briefly slows. In an area... <gasps> this should work. Yes. 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 Should be something useful yes. here. Yes. Yes. I'll take that for uh, for the boss fight especially. And then I'll, I'll go with the epic one because, you know, I'm cool with taking the extra challenge. It's fine. Oh, my God. Homing AoE. Homing AoE Poison Blast is a very fun concept. Can I sneak it around the back? I can. Sneak it around the back. Look at that. That's so cool. I love this. I love this build. Is it strong? It's pretty strong, and I think this upgrade will make it definitely stronger. But it is very fun. That is for sure. I love it. I love it. Strength, it's about like a like a seven or eight. It, it ain't like a ten or something like we've had this the past few episodes. But it's it's a ten on the fun scale. It's a ten on the the fun and thematically uh, consistent scale. We are on a it's like a, a spreading hangover kick right now. Fun for all. Bye. All right, so now those are up to the blue rank, just like that. We will. Uh, the thing is, it it ranks up very quickly in uh, in sticks. Oh my god, I love this! Oh, that was that is exactly one of the things that we needed. I wonder how piercing works with this homing. It probably it's either amazing or terrible. I don't know. I would think it would be amazing with the homing. You'd think it would just slowly kind of like pierce through everybody. Okay. Oop, ouch. But yeah, I love it. Like it, love it, gotta have it. There's very, very little reason to not, but also very little reason to. I'm actually going to skip the shop so that we can just spend our money in, um, in whatchamacallit. Ooh. Ooh. I'm going to do this for, this will help us on the boss fights. So we can spend our money in the final zone instead, is kind of what I was getting at there. Um, I don't like that there's only two foes here. These two. Of course. The monster has returned in a vainglorious attempt to wrest the title champion from me. I couldn't care less about your title. I wonder if he ever shouldn't you share it with a minotaur? Is nice to you. more than half the reason ever. you've been in any trouble. You'll not drive a wedge between us, fiend. Asterius and I share a fraternal bond forged from the strongest bronze, nay, adamant. You have caused us both offense. So die. 
you really, you, you, you gotta let him speak for you, Asterius. My favorite thing about fighting Asterius early is always just the fact that we do get to start this fight with him at lower HP. I love that stuff. What was that? Was he taunting me? Trying to see if we can maybe, like, squeak out a little bit of uh, bonus damage against Theseus here. You know, we got we got poison. We can we can cheese it a little bit, right? We can we can bop him a, a little. Yep, yep, yep. Whoop, 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 whoop. It's kind of the benefit of this run here. Is is he taunting me? Are you taunting me, Minotaur? But we're gonna save up our. Uh, a remaining call here for the final phase. Oop. I was too busy trying to dodge this attack that I didn't try to dodge the other. I've never actually I've never actually left them both alive at the same time when that happened. I've never had that happen. I regret it immensely. I regret it. I regret it like mad. It was. I would not call it a good. I would not call it a good decision. We're gonna be fine. Like nothing is actually that big of a deal here. But it was a bad idea, and I will not do it again. I. I. I think I firmly proved to myself that I've been doing it the right way. Meta progress. All right. For our ending here, I will take, let's see, Lucky Tooth, 38. Gives us 38, and then it gives us a total of, uh, I mean, well, let's just basically, basically say 80. So this actually does give us more HP over the course of this here, and I actually broke my chair. One moment. Uh, let's take this time while I fix my chair. If you enjoy the video, press the like button. It takes no time at all, and it is one of the major ways that you can help the channel rank higher Ouch. in search results. <laughs> Hold on. If you really want this series and this channel to pop off, liking and commenting as you've been doing is the number one way to do so. To help me rank higher than other videos and have people find the series. It's a great way to help, and it doesn't take any time. So consider tabbing back in if you're just doing an audio-only thing and uh, and hitting that bouton. Almost I hate to ask, but it it, it it matters a lot. It really does. Hmm. Hmm. I'll take this one. Go for HP there. All right. All right, definitely go for Dionysus. It's a very core thing to our build. We can definitely increase our uh, our hangover damage. This I know. Of this, I'm sure. We're probably going to get our epic rank either. He yeah, I was going to say here, here or the next room. So boom, those are up to epic now. So now it is a net increase. Took a little while for I mean, took a little while for it to be a net increase, but I know it's like. Some, a lot of people probably probably hate that boon. I, I betcha. I could see that being one that a lot of people think is terrible. And I don't necessarily think it's great. I just think it's fun. Not yet. I like letting just uh, just getting a handful and just li really letting them shine. You know, is that a good plan? Probably not. It should, it's probably best to you know like really really spread out. Make sure you're not. You don't have weaknesses all over the place. And there we go. Boom. They're at heroic. <laughs> Just like that. Took so long. That's the most gigantic vermin I've ever seen. R-O-U-S. Get that backstab. I would love if there was one other unit here. There we are. You can do a whole bunch of extra damage now. If we can make sure that they are all poisoned at the same time. This is just this is just an inordinate amount of uh, of poison pools. There's a 
poison pool up here the whole time, too. I really, really hate this guy. Definitely one of my least favorite bosses, or least favorite rooms in this, uh, this zone, for sure. Point. Okay, using Fountain Restore, that's a little... Let's go with take less damage at 40% or below. I feel like it's the one of the things that could really do the most at this point. Inside the filth and crusted layers carved into the looming edifices of the underworld lie such terrible abominations that not even Grim Lord Hades is inclined to speak of them. This gigantic vermin head deserves a lot more credit if you ask me. Yeah. Yeah. Got to keep searching. I like the idea of going for the HP. Especially if we can get the HP boost in before the uh, the well, that'll help us out. Just a little bit. Whoop. Just a just a just a touch. Just a touch. And having a bunch of extra HP when you have a percentage uh, of health that you take damage less damage at, you know? A high flat amount is going to be a very big deal. We already have a high flat amount. Two, 200 is a high amount of health. I would often consider. Bloop. Bye bye. No use. I feel like this is a good, definitely a good showcase of um, what exactly scales better with the gun compared to think something like the sword or the bow. And. That's why a lot of the times early on in this series, yeah, I kind of, I kind of felt that vibe. Why a lot of times early in the series, I was like, no, I don't really want Hangover on my sword. You can, you can probably see it very clearly now why I think it's better here. It's just, it's so easy to get the, the five stack, like, so easy. There is a boon that does increase the stack all the way up to ten, which is something I would have loved today. That would have been so good. Our, our call would destroy bosses, and then our base attacks would, honestly, basically destroy bosses as well. Like, imagine, we'd basically be doing almost twice as much damage. Not quite, because a lot of our damage is coming from our base gun right now, too. Wow, that was a bad dodge. Whoop. It, 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 it. All right, but yeah, there's something about the gun that it's It's not a, I'm not saying it's a clunkily designed weapon, but it is I Use it clunkily and I think it largely centers around the uh, the reload mechanic. I do think so for me I think that I don't use it very very well and that's why there is a, a, a Daedalus Hammer upgrade, or at least there was, that maybe it was replaced for, wow, for the one that we saw today that actually gave you literally infinite ammo without having to reload, and I did enjoy that a lot. Okay. Boop, 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 boop. Okay, God Gauge depleted. Cool enough, whatever. Whatever, pop and lock them. There we go. Want three. Three is the magic number. Magic number. You can definitely see how much less damage we do to a single target. Delicious. So, yeah. We go from seven to eight, and that's one thing that I like about upgrading, um... No. About upgrading hangover effects is... There's diminishing returns, but it never goes lower than one. It never goes lower than one. I should have saved up my money for Artemis. I don't want to lose the ability to stick my gem in an enemy, and that's what that one will do. We'll have a, we'll, we'll almost certainly have a run where we can showcase what that looks like. I don't think it's going to be today. I think we would, we would lose effectiveness this run if we, uh, if we got that one. Because if you remember, like, the, uh, the festive fog, how we lobbed the gem, 
up in the air and it drops on the ground. And it doesn't stick in the enemies. It, it is kind of same energy, basically. Same energy, basically. Whoop, whoop. We might as well look. Is there anything worth selling? Hot stuff. Stonks. <laughs> I, I, I'm not using it very much. And it's 300 bucks. That's enough to get a whole new Artemis boon that may be way more relevant to our run. No way. 300 bucks. So it's a wild, wild choice, I'm sure. Like, some people probably are like, no! But without other upgrades to our special damage or Daedalus hammers or uh, chaos boons, I'm kind of like, I'm neutral on it. I'm neutral on it for this run right now. Can't do that. The going for a special focus route is definitely something I enjoy with this gun, especially if you get the right Daedalus. You get the right Daedalus stuff, it slaps. Okay. At this point, yeah, don't want to focus anymore. This is gone bad. I thought I did it. Didn't want to focus down any of the uh, the ads. That was bad. That was terrible. I, there's no way we're getting to 10 stacks of chill, and I already said why I don't want that. So I guess I'll get this, even though it is no more progress with our, our fate list. A little displeased. I probably shouldn't be clearing out since we're clearly, we're starting to take extra damage. But here, maybe this will be a wise choice. Maybe. Don't want to go for healing if it's here. How much is it? 45. I can use this. Sure. Sure, 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 sure. Worcester, sure. But we should get um, at least a hundred bucks here. I'm a, I'm a little concerned that I just uh, toasted myself. Worst comes to worst, we'll get the Palm of Power, which is an upgraded Palm of Power. That'll give us a double rank up anyways. In something which is hardly a bad pickup. Not yet. If you ask me. Okay. Thank you, Trap. It's no use. Beautiful. What are we at? 348. I have I am concerned that it's gonna give us a hundred and it's not enough. But it's a it's not an epic fight, so it's not an epic reward, not an elite reward. So I've definitely definitely got concerns there that we are not gonna get enough. Spread the love. It's not a third target, you say. Two enemies, our least favorite amount of enemies. Okay. Close call. Close call. All right, Lady Artemis. Redeem. Redeem yourself, Fish Master. That is a scuffer. Fish Master redeemed. Thank you, mate. There's pressure points. I was looking for it. The widely feared and many-headed Cerberus, the underworld sentinel presides over the entrance to this realm, devouring whole those fool enough to make attempts to flee. He loves to eat. Can you blame him? Here you go! A solitary weakness, Sator Sax, proved terribly effective once again. Thank you. 
It's bribery. Server's bribed. It's bribery. <laughs> Server's bribed. It's not bribery. Okay. All right, Papa. I'm going to poison you, Papa. I'm back, Father. This cold white substance falling slowly from the heavens. Snow, they call it. Look carefully upon each fleck. Tiny crystals, but structurally weak. They melt. This surface realm, it is held up by mine. If you're quite finished teaching me about this snow phenomenon, can we get on with brutally trying to kill each other here? You wish to have your mortal colored blood spill once again upon this bed of snow, then fine. What? Let us proceed. When's the last time you've killed me, Papa? I guess with my blood being spilled doesn't mean he's doing a moiter. Doesn't mean he's actually killed me. Summon ads. For the first time ever, I want you to summon ads, papa. And I will, yeah, for the first time ever as well, I will probably want to save my call as well for the second phase. Well, if he's not going to spawn more, then we might as well get it killed. We can use those as targets. God, just having quintuple dash for this fight changes everything for me. You already have, man. Okay. Eh. Well, if you're gonna summon things that make you invincible, obviously those need to go. Okay. Damage should be quite good there for a bit. You know what? Fine. Since it seems like we can stack it very quickly. Oh. It's not doing them great. Not really. The damage ain't great. Oh, heck. You tell your loyal subjects to stay out of this? Another invincibility boyo, huh? That ruins the whole strat. It genuinely do. I do like that uh, the ads are definitely like less of a concern for us here than they normally are. You almost done here, son? Boink, boink, boink. <laughs> All right, then, boy. You've stirred my anger suitably by now. Rocking around the papa tree. We are not finished. Come on. Part of this phase is actually going to be really nice because we're going to be able to... Uh, we're going to be able to do damage from beyond the, uh, the pillars. Which is very much... Oops something that is very helpful in this fight in this phase I'm trying to see if we can kill as many of these pillars as we can so we don't have to deal with them boink 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 boink, boink. nice try dad Nice try, Dan. That's yeah, fine. <laughs> okay. I would love for you to do your uh, your laser beam attack. Oh, I thought I had my uh, my greater call. It's taking a long time. Showcasing our uh, our weakness against a single target. No more. Too far away. Keep on missing the greater call, but that's I'm actually like fine with it. Well. 
Well, you know I don't have to try against you right now, don't you, Papa? You know I don't have to try, right? <laughs> not even, not even close. We had a death defy, a death defy, and a skelly death defy left. Not even close. We're family. There's no escaping that. There. Bye. In the name of Hades. Boop, boop, boop. Get out of that. Let's see. What do we... What do we... That was definitely a focus. Just to, just get a little bit of a... Sure, that was a focus, too. That was a focus. What else do we have? That was fun. That was fun. Get rid of that, actually. Don't do that. Yeah, something like that. that. I'd say that that was kind of our uh, our core component. Pressure points probably did help quite a bit for the final fight there as well. But alas, there we go. Did Exegriff just shudder? Did Exegriff just shudder? Did it? Oh, do I unlock the... Oh, now that I want to run with every weapon? Or have I want to run with every weapon? I haven't... Technically, I haven't run a one. Run a run a one a one a run a one with the shield or spear, right? Probably not. So bright. Uh. My mother! Can I give you a gift? No. Just want to make sure there's nothing, nothing sparkly. So good to see you again, Zagreus. Since last you left, I couldn't help but think the worst about what happened after I had left, or soon before. You mentioned Nix. You don't suppose that she and Hades? wanted me out of the way I just don't think that can be though let me ask you how long did you know father and Nix for that matter did they seem trustworthy yes I knew them long enough to have decided yes that they were trustworthy as much as anyone I've ever met but I also know never to be trusting to a fault I have to consider the possibility I was deceived Especially since neither of them is being forthcoming with me even now, right? And yet, I have this feeling something else is going on, Mother. The way that Father speaks of you, the way Nick speaks of you, I think they care for you. <laughs> well, they have a funny way of showing it, I think. Your father, so... You have to get through him each time you visit me? I do. Mother, what if... What if Father thinks that he's protecting you? Have you considered that protecting me why Zagreus what do you mean by that as you can see I can fend for myself well uh, you're from Olympus aren't you but the gods none of them seem to know you're here so what how would you know something like that Zagreus ah oh, curse the fates you're leaving me again I... I won't be long. Hmm. Uh, mm, uh. Protect them, <sighs> huh? Hold that thought, mother. Papa is a good guy? Maybe. I mean, I, I think that that's... I've kind of generally thought that that's going to be the died? ending ending. It's not, not, not like that. It's not nothing that. stabbed you? But we'll see. You? Poisoned you? Burned you? Crushed you? Blew you to bits? Turned you to stone? But you're back here. Must have been those natural causes mortals talk about. <laughs> Probably. Everything is as it always was. Hold on, Papa. Oh, good boy. I see you got a big important, but I need to do a pet first. I'm sorry he disturbed you, Cerberus. Okay. What else? Uh, ooh. What's going on here? I've done the best I could preparing him. Though I'm fearful it was not enough. No one ever has escaped this place. I have a your lot. Your expertise has readied him, Achilles. Yet I sense it is your confidence in him which spurs him on. Do not lose faith in yourself now, lest soon he do the same. My faith is prone to shakiness at times. Okay, well obviously we'll go back and we'll get that papa papa talking going on. Here's what I caught. Oh, we did turn it in last time. We're settled up. What do we get? I don't want the urns. 
<laughs> I actively don't want the urns yet because it just gives me something for people to be like, you missed the golden pot for. But also, more importantly, I do genuinely want to save my gems for the trove, if anything. Oh, Deuce is down there. Finished a prophecy, too. Things are looking good for old Rita McGee. Have a nice day. Even though you don't want to live here anymore, Your Highness. And there she goes again. Oh, that's it. Okay. What do we get completed here? Another Infernal Arms. Acquire each of the weapons. Oh, okay. just literally get them. Okay. Legendary weapons there. Oh my god, we keep on yeah, we keep on getting more and more and more missions here. We are We have not met one important NPC. Which one is it? Ah, I know who it is. We have not met. Spoiler. That's right. Okay. All right, all right, all right. So, what does it take to unlock the next one? 20 keys. 20 keys. That's quite a bit, man. Quite a bit. Investigate the infernal arms. What? Hell is yeah! Exodus. Yes! You're telling me your secrets. We've done it! Twin fists of Yes! Hey. Combined surely cannot be stopped. So, now, we have now gotten the ability to upgrade our weapons so that they will do extra damage or, or whatever, you know, whatever it has beneath that specific, specific aspect, specific aspect, or we can unlock new ones entirely. So, we are going to, let's, uh... Let's pick this up early. Why not? Boom. We got the aspect of Achilles here. After you special, you can retrieve your spear with Raging Rush instead. So that's going to be something we showcase tomorrow. But just to give you a little hint here, we get to do a full-on charge up, dash to it, and do extra damage afterwards. We're going to play with that tomorrow for sure. We got the extra blood, uh, extra darkness as well. It's more what I meant to say there. But we're going to hold on to the Titan's blood. Uh, we could upgrade each thing individually. I'm probably just going to go around and preemptively unlock the first rank of everything here. So we can showcase. Don't worry about it, Skelly. All right, so now you can see here, all of our weapons are totally different. They're all going to have unique effects to them. A lot of them are with their special or their type of attack. And then all of them will have a super unique, like wildly unique final aspect that we will have to get at a future date, which I am very excited about. Which almost, for a lot of them, or literally all of them, almost turns them into a completely different weapon. It's It's crazy. Uh, but there we go. We've effectively kind of unlocked new characters or if you will or these are like new ca the, All the weapons are characters and each of these are like subclasses for the characters It's probably the best way of really uh, showcasing it there, but It's one of the major ways to make yourself stronger that we have not We had not unlocked yet. It's an it's a huge way to make yourself stronger uh, To the point where there's even like past. up here you get bonus attack speed you can uh, get it up to like an extra 15% attack speed and movement speed or like, you know, there, there's a ton, a ton to, to play around with now. But that is going to do it. We will talk so to Skelly. Happened while you were out, boy, yo. Uh, one of your weapon holder things back there, it picked up this eerie glow. C could see it from the corner of my eye. Calm down, Skelly. I'm sure whatever it is, is perfectly normal for a legendary semi-sentient titan slaying weapon from the dawn of time. That's just it. Those weapons of yours, they have seen some real business, pal. You're giving them a real workout, so maybe they're starting to like you or something. Loosening up a bit, you know, like you and me. That's an imaginative right. theory, mate. But that is that, and that is going to do it for today. I shall throw in my darkness, I think, or Night should I? Eh. Let's save up for our final death defiance. That's going to do it for today. Thank you but for watching. As I said prior, if you enjoyed the video, please do hit the like button. It takes half a second, and I'll, I'll say it again here just to remind you. And it helps a hell of a lot 
and check out the channel for roguelikes and more every single day. Hades will continue daily as long as you guys keep supporting it in the way you have. And I once again say thank you for making this genuinely the best comment section I've ever had on any of my series that I've ever launched in my eight plus years of doing YouTube. Genuinely. Thank you, thank you, and I will see you next time. Bye.